Hey, doll collector, action figure collector, model collectors, um, gift giver, toy givers, all around in between. It, welcome back to Caspian Shows. I'm back here with another video, and this one is with um, just continuing on with some of the um, Rainbow Hide dolls that I've got recently. Here it is the um, still the first week in July. You know what I mean. And um, I have been wanting Daria for a long time. Like, uh, gosh, she is just like, I just like think she's really pretty. I love her skin tone and her eye color. The clothes is like really, really cool and versatile. Like, I really want to do a lot with just this doll in general. Like, the quality it's serving, you know, like different looks. Like, seriously. Um, yeah, I think it's going, I'm sure it's going to be a lot, you know what I mean? And it might look pretty simple, but I love versatile pieces. And this doll right here, it just serves so many. I love both of these shoes. Like, even if I do, like, any you know, different repaints and stuff like that. I, she is definitely, like, one of my faves, just, like, out the whole series in general. Um... I really love Daphne Minton from this line as well, and Cheryl Myers. I haven't got them two yet, but I think I will get them. Darius is actually the first one I've got from this line, but I've seen I've seen all of them in person, absolutely, and at different prices. But I I just kind of wanted to wait on that line before I got any of them, just because I was buying so much other Rainbow High stuff, and I don't, you know, um. I try to budget when I'm shopping. I really do like try to catch them when they're on sales and stuff like that. But I've seen these girls on sale and they're, they're all, especially like around now, a lot more of them are coming out on sale. So they are definitely some to kind of look out if you haven't got all of them yet. Um, but I just want to go ahead and get Daria out because like her box was getting messed up. Like when I seen her in the store, her box was like kind of ripped. So I got her. I can't even like really remember if it was like a discounted price, but, um, yeah, I, no, I'm pretty sure it was still full price. It was about like $25, I think. And then she had to like, um, it was just kind of like ripped, you know, and I had to take that out like that. And it was just, anyway, but I just wanted her because she was the only one that they had in there. And I want to get this out of the box. So let's check. Yes, I absolutely love, love how she came out the box, like. She's absolutely beautiful. Now, it took a little long time to get her out of the box, you know, with the hair and everything. I guess it was because, like, how specific her curls were. Because this doll does have a lot of curls. So, it was, like, a lot of um, the bands in there that you had to clip out. I mean, to cut out or whatever. Other than that, it was very smooth getting her out. But, yes, yeah, like, oh, my God. The quality on her is just serving, like, even, like, the makeup on this doll. I don't mind. She has a malfunction right here, if y'all can see it, like with the lip on the pink. But I don't mind. It just is so subtle. And this doll is pretty, even though, like, I'm going to re repaint her and stuff like that. Like, I think, like, she has, like, really one of the most, like, kind of very vibrant but subtle, like, eyeshadow and makeup look. It's just so pretty. And, and like, it looks matte. Unlike the Series 1 girl, they were really, really shiny and sparkly, which I didn't mind either. But she looks closer to, like, a matte that I am just loving. I am just here for. Like, this jacket is so cute with a two-tone. Uh, it's kind of got, like, a like a solid wash um, print, but it's, like, dark. And it has, like, the roses on the side, like, with the gold stitching. Little gold buckle on the uh the uh I said a little gold buckle on the button there. Yes, it's so cute. I'm sorry, it's actually silver. And same on this side, silver buttons going along. Yes, we got a little pink slip dress that is absolutely beautiful. It says magic all the way around. Okay, uh, the background is black, but the words are just hot pink. And it is so cute all the way around the back. Her, yeah, her jacket also has roses on the other half. Yeah, she's got like these cutouts on the sleeve right there. and make it so cute. That's why I said everything is so versatile. I think it'll look, everything will really look a lot better separated. Here are her shoes. 
They are like some cute platform booties almost. And they got like a red um, shoelace that kind of wraps around the back there. Uh, roses all the way up the sides. Really, really cute. It looked like her socks has roses. But we'll get everything down and, and see how everything kind of looks more like versatile. Because versatile, I really love this outfit, y'all. And I'm sorry if y'all be wanting me to do that and others where I really don't break it down as much. I be wanting to, but... um. You know, I can do like a um, a rainbow high fashion show. I think that'll be cool. I do want to get like a lot of the storage bins to be able to do that. And I want like, um, I want them to do that. I don't want rainbow high to like actually give us like something like a stage, like the, the runway stage for like a, a play set. I think that would be so cute if we could get something like that. But um, hold on y'all. Okay, and here we go here. Her top is just like a little white crop top. Like, so cute. Like, oh my gosh. So, I'm going to go ahead and get everything else unboxed. And let's see what's going on. Yep, and she absolutely did have roses on her socks. They're uh, right about like mid, right above mid-ankle there. So, yeah. They're kind of like a good stretchy mesh. Kind of like the material that was around or close to what was around the, uh, the stitching of her dress. Okay, like here are her heels. They're so cute. They're like red, strappy. They got RH done on the side. They got a buckle at the top. Got the, like these cute um, flowers at the bottom. Like she just had, she gives me like this such a Betsy Johnson. Like just mixed with this uh, kind of like a cute doche maybe or gosh it's just it's really more like i feel like i see like a lot of betsy johnson inspiration with her but she is just so like just cute and just like her style is just like i don't know i really love it like kind of like the alternative you know I, I would not have paired everything together, but just everything that they gave us, I really, really admire. The quality of it is just such good, and everything is just so versatile. I just, I love it, so I couldn't be mad at how they styled this, to be honest. But one minute, y'all, I'm going to get everything else out of the back. Okay, y'all, and here we are with the cute little pinstripe skirt and crop top suit. I think it is so cute. It's got, like, the little, um... Uh, Pins here on the side. Silver, the quality is absolutely beautiful. Roses on the side. It's so soft. Oh my goodness. And on the top here, just some buttons, silver buttons going down the side with the ribbons up to the top. And it's like got a cut sleeve cut out at the top that goes all the way down. Love this bag here. It's leather and it has the roses on the top. Oh, it actually is a, easily opens with Velcro there. Such good quality. Look at this. Mattel could never look at that. Hologram go on the side there. That is just everything. Like, come on now, girl. What are they doing with that? Oh my goodness. Yes, honey. And see, I actually think that this suit right here was looking cute cutely more paired with the jacket you know and them shoes like come on now that's all she would have needed girl or even the heels yeah i'm sorry those heels this with the heels she really didn't need the jacket the jacket is parable for like a good um cool spring night look or fall, festa fall. Honey, that is just rocking. And I love how she came with her pink stand. Like, oh my gosh. You all, Daria is one of my favorites for real. She's so cute. I'm glad MGA delivered because she definitely slayed. And y'all, let me know what you think if y'all have her. Should, do y'all want me to get the rest on that line and go over them as well? 
or um just keep getting my favorites from that line what did y'all want to see just keep um letting me know i really appreciate the comments y'all please hit that like button and subscribe subscribe if you didn't and um i got bella parker to do here on the next one i will see y'all later and also after i get uh bella parker i still have that monster high haul coming up but also i wanted to do um one of the mermaid mermaids dolls that i got y'all i gotta do some reviews over them as well and also some of the other rainbow high dolls that i got that's just not from um from the box okay so i'll see y'all in the next one stay cool uh love someone love everybody if you can but please love something y'all and peace